Welcome everybody to a new series that will hopefully continue on forever because it's going to be awesome. This is Ace Docky and D Winget plays Universal Electricity with a little add in of Thongcraft. Howdy. Now that's not what I say. What do I say? I don't even know. It's been so long. It's been like almost a week <laughs> since I've recorded something. <laughs> I was going to say, Howdy does not say to you. <laughs> I have totally no idea what I would normally say here. It's been so long. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> um, hi. <laughs> that doesn't sound right either. Um, so yeah, let, let's. I guess let's run everyone through the mods we got first. So, um, mm. that's a long laundry list. I'll get my thing up here. Just one second. Yeah, we got. Um, well, all of the mods that are part of universal electricity. So. That includes mechanism, um, atomic science, dark mods, which are including assembly lines. There's a farm tech, fluid machines. This is be interesting. Uh, Galactic craft is in here. We have <coughs> ice BM contraptions, explosions, and sentry guns, which is awesome. Mechanism is in here, and we understand it is overpowered, but we don't care. Uh, and mine, the, mine yes? chem for when we just have to be all chemical. Yeah, mine chem. <laughs> Um, modular power suits. Modular force fields as well. Yep, that was the NFFS. And like I said before, Thomcraft, we have damage indicators, inventory tweaks, mouse tweaks. Uh, am I missing anything? Um, whoops, done. I keep right clicking. Infernal mobs, iron chests. I think Thormic Tinker is about the only thing that we didn't say. Yep. So. There are going to be times when we're just going to hide. I'm sorry, what did you just say? Which part? Uh, I heard you say there are times when, and then it sounded like. Jip, 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 jip. Uh, that we're going to run away from mobs and be scared because oh. they're mean. Absolutely. And yeah, like I said, we. Not we can't attack them with stone bolts. It's impossible. Well, I think you can, but they just kill you. Over and over and over. <laughs> That's exactly <laughs> it. I think it's going to be a lot like on your Simucraft Let's Play, where you had like five zombies cowering, you know, and they they had you cornered at your bed, and were like just killing you, and then you were respawning, and then they were killing you again. <laughs> yeah. They're going to kill you until you die from it. Um, so this is fun. It's kind of clear in the spot for us. This is why I hate jungles. But, you know, I've got, like, cocoa beans. So we, we're going to have cookies. Except they don't know the future saturation. Did, did we mention Zan's minimap? Uh, no, but you can tell that is definitely in oh, I'm can... assuming that the mobs, when they're kind of grayed out, means they're underground. And if in... they're kind of full color, then that means they're right next to your face. I, I hope that's not the case, because I hope not to see them right next to me like that. <laughs> There's a thingy over there. Oh really, a thingy? Yeah, come, come, it's <laughs> come with me. It's a thingy. <laughs> I think it's a. I mean, I, I haven't had anything to do with Thorncraft Four, so I think it's, it's a Thorncraft Four, uh, like a obsidian black standing up. What do they call them? Thing. <laughs> People <laughs> shout at me louder. T totem? No, totem obelisk. Is that what they're called? That's what they used to be called. I'm not sure if that's what they still are called. Are they, are they good things or bad things? I think they're good things if you can work them right. Okay. I'm well, if they're thinking. good things, we're building our base here. I have to definitely do some watching of um, Chris's let's. Uh, mm hmm. That thing. Um, what do you call it? Dang it. Let's it play? Is tutorials. Oh. <laughs> I, I, I've been trying to kind of avoid those. I thought I could just wing it. It's really hard to wing it. Other than, uh, I mean, okay. that is my last name, and I, it's awesome, but it doesn't always work. We didn't gather very much wood, so it would probably be useful to make some tools with those two blocks. I think nine lots of cocoa beans is going to be sufficient. Nine. Yeah, you're right. You're going to make us live in the desert. Okay. I've never uh, actually lived in the desert in, in any kind of... There you go. Have an axe. You need to get me two more planks. 
I made too many sticks. <laughs> Smooth. While you're doing that, I'm going to go get that sugar cane I saw a moment ago and make a sugar cane farm. Um, oh, we should have totally put in tree capitator if we're going to be living in this jungle. Oh. I thought, yeah, we, t we, yeah, we should have. I absolutely agree with you. It will be in for next time. <laughs> there is a very good chance. And I'm ho we're hoping that this can be like a once a week kind of series. More or less. Because um, a stocky's availability and mine is going to be coming cut down very much short, shortly. Yeah. Me heading back to Australia is going to put a 14 hour or no 16, 16 hour, hour time zone difference in between us and that may make things challenging. Yeah. Uh, Ryan's about 18 from me. I think. If I, think, I remember last, last time I talked to him anyway. That's what we... Um, if, if I'm going to be 16... Maybe he's only 17. He's half an hour behind where I'll be. Half an hour? That's it? Yeah. How does that... How does it... There's no half hours in time zones. Pretty sure. <laughs> There's 24 time zones. Each Se hour. Says you. <laughs> <laughs> does Australia have a time zone we don't know about? I'm, I'm positive that... Someone correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm positive Adelaide's half an hour behind Melbourne. Ooh, check this out. There's a hole in the ground that goes straight to a cave. Really? <laughs> <laughs> PvP is clearly off. <laughs> Thank goodness for that. It must have been like, hey. Oh, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> that's not. That's, that's totally not cool. Um. Did you get like wood so that we can make? Crap. <laughs> did you get wood so we can make tools? Yes, I did. I gotta get myself out of a hole though. No, no. Give me a piece of wood. Hey. <laughs> we're gonna get killed too because it's yeah. evening. It is, and we're out in the middle of a desert. It could be worse. How could this be worse? Mm, I'm. Oh. That could make it worse. I just heard a zombie. <laughs> oh crap, a ferris zombie? What the heck is that? Oh, furious. Oh, I can't read. Um. <laughs> Will you make a sword? <laughs> if you give me more wood. <laughs> there you go. That's a hard... <laughs> that was hardly giving it to me. That was just like throwing it on the floor. Well, I've got a zombie chasing my face. I have like no health left. He's a big zombie too. He is a big zombie. I've got salmonella now. Awesome. We are so dead. There's two furious zombies. Oh, what? They get bigger too. What? They get bigger with your. Oh, do they get bigger every time they kill you? I don't know. He definitely got bigger. Well, I. Uh, they can't be good. <laughs> Um, oh, no, there we go. Uh, just a slight server issue then. I just fell through a world hole. Okay. Okay. Got creepers and skellies and... Ah! I didn't put game rules on. <laughs> I'm being attacked by a skeleton with cool boots. <laughs> this is not going well. Okay. Oh, there's an indie person. I'm being shot at and being attacked. The worst thing is the ones that are wearing the like the armor and stuff. Uh -huh. They don't. Hey, my shovel. Yeah, they they don't actually die in the sunshine either. But yeah, those furious zombies are infernal mobs. Because he had the red eyes and he was small, I actually thought he was a Thorncraft zombie. No, the the the, the, uh, the, the yeah, uh huh. That mob that you're that thing that you're talking about, mod. Here we go. If they're infernal mobs, they have blue health, blue status bars. Oh, really? Or purple, and they're like huge. It's like a boss. Awesome. Thing. I just got a creeper to blow up. 
Oh my gosh, we are so screwed. <laughs> it's got to be daytime somewhere. <laughs> Whoa! Someone just hit me and threw me in the air. It's the spider thing, I think. Oh, Skelly just shot at me. Oh, Skelly with boots is going to shoot at me. Creeper's going to blow me up. This Ow. game is so not cool. And you took my shovel. Why did you take my shovel? I can't even dig myself into a hole fast enough. Ooh, he's got... <laughs> he's got yellow boots and he's got blue boots. Uh, I'm just going to admire their shoes while they kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly oh, something was uh, not thought out here. I just fell through another world. I, I think the problem was that you started it way too late. You know, it should have been like early in the morning because we've only been, what, playing for 10 minutes? Uh -huh. That makes it night time, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm hiding in this tree now. I got an idea here. Come get me, mobs. I'm standing... Dude, it's like, it's not a mob that makes you jump. Or someone's got magic powers. Because I wasn't around anything and I just jumped really high. I think I'm going to have to pause my recording because I just buried myself in a two block high dark hole. <laughs> <laughs> Something's got magic powers is in throwing me around. I'm trying to kill them with cacti. Is it working for you? Uh, kind of. The problem is I'm sure I can survive till morning by just running around frantically. The downside is just... Wow, that furious zombie is m like... Ginormous. <laughs> He's huge. <laughs> He's I want to know that is a cool feature. Growing zombies. Whoa! <laughs> it's like you're not around anybody, so somebody's got magic powers. I, I, I don't like it. I'm scared now. Dig, dig fast. That's what I'm doing. Well, you know, I was, like, uh, you know, I had dug myself into a hole and was hiding, and then decided that that wouldn't be a very good episode for people to watch, so now I'm just going to run around randomly for a while. I saw it, I can, there's, there's a light here. Why, there's a, the, why is there a light? Where is there a light? I don't know where you are. Uh, 252, 196. Oh, no. Cinder pearls or cinder cinder. Things. No, there's not. There's nothing there. Like the ground's empty. Stop it! Cut it out! Everyone, leave me alone! <laughs> I'm being chased by a baby zombie with armor. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Man, there are so many of them wearing armor. Did you put this on like crazy ridiculous hardcore mode? Ah, stop it! This is normal mode, man. No, my butt. <laughs> not nothing about this is normal. <laughs> well. There's a web here. Does the spiders even shoot webs now? I think so. It's, that is an infernal mob. There's an infernal creeper. Ow! Die. Come on, die. But don't blow up my cactus. Someone just set everything on fire. That's an infernal, infernal creeper. <laughs> this is not going well. I'm hiding underwater. Badly. What is that moon. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Almost. Can we survive another five minutes? Even though this episode has been going for like 13? No. <laughs> <coughs> Based on the law of averages of how many times we've already died and how long we've been running this episode for, uh, no. <laughs> no. Thankfully, Woo! I can swim as fast as a spider can. Is the sun coming up? No, I just got blown into the air again. Oh. You missed. Missed again. I have half a heart left. And I'm hungry, and I'm being chased by a mini zombie who's wearing some shiny threads. Shiny, shiny. Let's see, we still had a problem with all these. I think it's actually. Ah. Oh. They're wearing armor. <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 do. I keep getting like null pointer exceptions in the Minecraft render, which is what makes me fall through the world. Chicken? I rescued a chicken. The night has been a success. Dawn is breaking. 
So is my will to live. <laughs> we can't be this bad, can we? <laughs> we chose the desert, for starters, which offers no protection. Ha! I am playing King of the Mountain with these zombies. And winning. Although my sword's about to break. I found a pretty safe spot. It just broke. No! Oh! I thought Into that was going to end in tears. Into that cactus. Come on. Hurt yourself. Okay. Do we have any tools left? Did any of our swords survive the night? Uh, I just broke one. And I'm now being chased by, zomb with, by zombies with armor on. Okay. Maybe we need to take a slight intermission from the recording and try to see if we can not die for a few minutes. Okay. We are going to pause the video and come back when we are not dead. <laughs> <laughs> see you guys back soon. Welcome back, guys. Um, we've holed ourselves up in this little tiny area here. Um, ignore that latest death marker. We're being attacked by infernal mobs. Yep, yeah, just ignore that latest death marker. Yes, the infernal mobs are making our life uh, difficult. Difficult is putting it mildly. Did you make a pick? Uh, I have your pick. Can I have my pick? Then we can start <laughs> yes. making some stone tools. Yes, you can. Okay. Yeah, so basically, like he said, we've dug a hole. And we're and hiding we in it like... Here. We're hiding in it like little scaredies. This is not the most brilliant moment in Minecraft for me. Infernal mobs are tough. <laughs> yes, they are. Now, now you, you may have mentioned that. I may not have listened. But I've been told when you kill them, you get really good stuff. And that must make it worthwhile, right? I hit better. Okay. The, the thing is, though, that the, the killing them is appearing to be difficult. Yeah. I thought it was going to be, you know, you attack them and they die. I didn't realize you hit them and they make you explode and then you die. <laughs> I'm not sure where that fits in. I have lots of coal though. That's got to be a good thing. I have just found tin. Oh, I, yeah, we should be okay. There's not any. Yeah, we'll be fine. Are you causing problems? Well, I was just thinking about the mods that were installed and if there would be more than one or generation problem. I don't think that should be the case. Even if there is, I don't think it's going to kill anyone. No. Not like those stupid mobs do. Okay. You're digging out from underneath me, aren't you? Uh, yeah, and I just made an oops. That doesn't sound good. It was n not real big deal. Okay. It was a uh, more of a aesthetics oops. Oh, they're the, they're the smallest kind of oops. They believe in an oops. Yeah. Okay, so don't dig that layer. Let's just dig down one more. Ooh, gravel. Wait, gravel's not as important as I thought it was. No, Tinkerer's construct is not installed. Yeah. Gravel provides little help. So this is going to be our not permanent base because both of us are pretty much sick and tired of being underground. underground. Although it could be the safest way to get away from the absolute horde of mobs that's above ground at the moment. Well, yeah, that's true. And then we'll just build a rocket and go to the moon and leave them behind. I think what we have to do is we have to just progressively make our little walled enclosure get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Yeah. That would probably be the safest. Okay, there's a, re a reasonable sized room. Okay, so if you hover your mouse over an ore and it comes up blue, that means it's a universal electricity ore. Oh, okay. So like, I, d I just got that copper with my stone pickaxe and it came up blue. So there are at least two kinds of copper. I wonder what else is adding in. Well, we have a couple mods. They're not all necessarily from the same config yeah. file. I 
think the two that we're going to have are the universal electricity ores and the TE or gen mod ores. Right. So thermal expansion ores will be in here. Okay, so that is the beginning of a base. We have a skylight to this outside. So yeah, we we can still see the outside world. So it's not a we're not living in a hole. Do you have any wood? Uh, yes, I have twenty-eight jungle wood and eight oak wood. That's good because I have none. So I have uh, about thirteen saplings. We're not going to grow an underground tree farm. We are not going to do that. <laughs> well. <laughs> <coughs> We will fence one in. I want to make a stairway that goes up. Can you put the crafting table back down? It's uh, in my inventory. Yes, I can. I meant to. Okay. How do I turn off that last dip? I don't want that marker on. Are you making stairs? Yes. Okay. Um... Do we no. have charcoal yet? I got no. I got seventeen coal. Do you want some coal? Yeah, it is for torches. Okay. I'm gonna try to use as little torches as possible and not completely kill myself at the same time. We have no renewable source of food. Other than cocoa beans, but you can't do a whole lot with cocoa beans. Not by themselves. Oh, I didn't think that through. That didn't go so well. <laughs> That's not functional, Isaki. Worthless. It's okay, I fixed it. We've decided that is a stockies motto. If you haven't already figured that out, that's a stockies motto. Ha! Is it functional? Okay, we're up to here now. How high is here? Okay, I have found iron. It makes you feel better. It's about to get even. Oh, it's about to get even less aesthetic. That doesn't make me feel better. Doesn't make me feel worse though. This is also... Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, man. Ah! Did you fall out? The, no, I found the zombie who's making me, like, shoot up in the air. He's just a regular yeah. zombie, just wearing a special hat and some funky threads. Yep. But as soon as you poke your head out, he pretty much blasts you into the air. Yep. How can we keep skipping all the copper? Because I'm in a hole with coal. Oh. I made a left turn, right turn. Oh. Tin? Tin. Um, okay, so uses for copper. We can make copper ingots. Great. Uses for copper ingots. Can I make bronze dust? Can I make copper chests. Coal generator. Ah, now we're talking. That needs a torch. Okay, let's let's have a look at some of these machines. We need to start doubling our ores. Yes, because I have iron. And I think I'd it's like called. Make... We need a, we need a power source to start with, so, so we're going to need the coal generator. So we're going to need three copper, four iron. I have four iron. And one aluminum wire. And I have. I said that to make you happy. It's aluminium. <laughs> uh, Chris totally botched my idea of aluminum now. Why is that? Because he made reference. He said he looked it up in like a couple of years ago, probably like 20 ah! years ago. They... We're not safe. Spiders. Oh, spiders. They, they, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Standardized they it. Standardized it. Oh, aluminium. They did. 
So us Americans are just stupid. <laughs> <clears throat> I didn't say that. I'm not disagreeing with you. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know English. <laughs> Even though that's supposed to be cave. Our foreign, our foreign <laughs> yeah, it's a foreign language to us. Now who has the short attention span? <laughs> <laughs> it's me, I know. I was hoping I found aluminum. I, I can't break it, sorry. I was going to try. You can't get aluminum? No, I was going to say, I was going to try and say aluminum, but it came out aluminum. I just broke my pick. Zombie! I think I smacked you instead of the zombie. Yes. <laughs> so not cool, man. Zombie's dead. Can you light it up a little? Oh, I only got one more torch. Better go this way. There's, there, there seems to be another kind of copper ore now. Yeah. And we have some uh And then there's shards. like a greenish tin ore as well. Yeah, there are lots of different kinds of ores in this mod pack. And you know what? I'm perfectly happy with that. I think it's going to take us a while until we can start to double them. So while we're not doubling them, let's just have lots of them. That sounds like a fair deal. Yeah, sounds fair. Forward mining base right here. And I am not above using any eye to cheat in the correct ore so that they all match. I don't know either. What was that? More tin. Can we not get these? Oh, we can. I thought you needed an iron pick. Apparently not. I thought that stuff down there was... Air shards. No, I thought the, the white stuff was aluminium. Tin. Really? Can't get amber. I wouldn't have found this cave if I wasn't going for... Uh, coal. It's just a little dark, and I have like no chest, and you have no chest. We need we need to make a chest that we can put this stuff in. I have sixteen more torches. It's not really too dark at the moment where I am, so I can what see well. What is that? Around. What is what? I can get it. Osm Osm uh, Os Os osmium? Osmium. That is good stuff. We need that. We need lots of that. More copper. What do we need it for, though? Um, Oop. I we need to make an enrichment chamber as soon as we can. So it needs enriched alloy. We just need a metallurgic infuser. Redstone. And oh, goodness. This is not anything like where Chris is playing. We Why has this got to be complicated? Updated version. Hmm. Okay, so we can't make an enrichment chamber without a metallurgic infuser. So how do we make a metallurgic infuser? We need to make a crusher. I think okay. that would be beneficial. Metal no, it's not. <laughs> okay, metallurgic infuser is pretty easy. We need one osmium ingot, two furnaces, four iron and two redstone. That's probably not going to take us too long to get to. Mm -mm. I found so much copper, but no iron. I thought you said you found three iron. Well, I found... Oh, I do have six now. But I'm not finding as much as I should. More osmium. What does osmium look like? Oh, bluish. Yes. Anyway, I think... We've probably just about recorded enough for this first episode. Maybe we should just do a bit of mining off camera. And, and then, then maybe come back when we've got a bit more stuff. Yeah, that might be good. We probably should make an iron pickaxe too and start getting some redstone. Because we need redstone to really progress. Do you have any more torches? Uh, yeah. I'm in the hole though. Here. Thank you. <laughs> I just want to light this way up a little bit so we don't have things joining us uninvited. Okay. So we'll call that an episode. We'll do some mining off camera and then we'll do some more recording later. We will. So thanks very much for watching, everyone. A stocky out. See you guys. <laughs>